Hello and welcome to DTWGED Prep Welcome. So in today's video, we're going to be looking at rates. Okay, the first video I've done on this um, GED Maths Crash Course is ratio. So I'm going to be adding the list on the Crash uh, Crash Course, the, uh, a video playlist. Okay, so I'll leave the link to the playlist in the description box below. By God's grace, by the end of this year, I want to be able to cover all topics on the GED syllabus for you, free for you. Okay, that's for the maths. All right. So to and any problems you're having in maths, it can the videos can help you. Already there are other videos that can help you, such as the 30 most difficult GED questions solved. You now go watch that video. It would also encourage you and you know tell you much uh, more about the GED test because those are like real practice GED um, test questions from the GED website on that particular video. I will leave the link, every useful video that you need for to pass your master's, I will leave the link in the video description box of this video. Okay, so please, um, before we get onto the video also, please try to help me by making this channel grow. Please try to subscribe to this channel to help us to grow. And also you can check our website for summary notes on your social studies, uh, that's your SSS and your science. Okay, summary notes, all complete. It's on the, the website, dtwgdprep.com and also practice questions. You can also join our Facebook group where over 8,000 members community to support you, ask your questions, get motivation, see free resources there to also support you. And finally, if you are interested in one-on-one -on -one tutoring, it has been a while you've gone to, uh, been to school and you need one-on-one -on -one tutoring to help you prepare for your maths test, I also do one-on-one -on -one tutoring. You can contact me, I'll leave my email address in the video description box of this video, okay, where you can contact me um, for further um, inquiries on the tutorial. All right, so now let's get on to this video now where we're talking about rates. Okay, so what, um, what's the rate? It's just, um, you know, a ratio that compares two quantities with different units is called a rate. Okay, now a rate uh, compares a quantity to one. All right, and in fraction, when we write rate in fraction form, its, denom its denominator is always one, okay? And in what form, a rate are often expressed using the word par. So when you see par something, like for example here, 65 miles per hour, all right? So the ratio is 65 miles for each hour. So you have the ratio 65 over, sorry, over one, okay? So... This is how rates are being um, expressed in fraction form. Your denominator is always what one. Now let's look at two examples here, okay, to explain rates, all right? It says here, if Bob earns $360 in 18 hours, how much does she earn per hour? You know, I've done a video on ratio. So this ratio here is dollar to what? How much does she earn per hour? So it's dollar to, to R. Okay, so now we have 360. Okay, the ratio here is $360 to what, 18 hours. All right, so we just reduce this. Um, 18 can go in 360. How many times will it go? 18 in 360, I think, uh, oh, well, I'm gonna bring up my GD calculator. Okay, but it's gonna affect our screen. All right, so uh, we have here, so it's $20 to one hour. Okay, so she's going to earn what twenty dollar per hour. So this is the answer for this. All right, and if you just starting to read, I've uh, in the video description box of this video, I've listed the best GED books to use to read. Okay, and also getting your GED calculator. There's some Amazon affiliate link there you can use to um, get those books. Okay, just to support me to earn commissions off Amazon. Okay, so check those books out, best books to read, to use. This is what I also use, okay, and recommend to students. And getting your GED calculator is also very important to learn how to do it. And there's a playlist of how to use the GED calculator on this channel also, okay? So Caroline, the next example is, Caroline drove 375 miles to New York City. Her car used 15 gallons of gas. What was the rate of miles to gallon rate of miles now this question didn't use par 
it used rates. Okay, so in, in your questions, especially in word problems, when you see par, they're referring to rates, okay, and sometimes they will use the word rates just directly. Okay, so miles to gallon. Our ratio here is what? Miles to gallon. All right, so how many miles? 375 over how many gallons did she use? 15 gallons. So we need to know how what was the rate of miles to gallon. So when we divide this, what do we get? Uh, 375 divided by, I'm using my own GD calculator right here, okay? So that will give us what, 25. So we have 25 miles, okay, for what, one gallon. So she used 25 miles per gallon. When you hear the per word, it means one, all right? 65 miles per hour, one, one, okay? That's one, per hour means one, okay? So anything after the per means one, all right? So she used how many miles to gallons? That she uh, that she got on this trip is what twenty five miles to one gallon. So every twenty five miles she uses one gallon. All right. So thank you for staying tuned to today's uh, class. And um, our next class will be on uh, uh, proportion, and we're going to do percentage. And after that, we'll do percentage increase, decrease. We're going to look at discounts also. All right. And this uh, part of your test, okay, in word problem form. All right, so thank you for staying tuned to today's class. Also, don't forget that Jesus Christ is coming soon. Please do give your life to Christ. For he is the way, he is the truth, and he is the life. So, see, there's, there is life after death. All right, there is life after death. And the one who is going to give us eternal life is Christ Jesus. Okay, he is the way, not a way. There are no, There's no other way to God than through Jesus, who has shed his precious blood for us, okay, and um, wiped away all our sins. So just come to him, accept him as your personal Lord and Savior, and he's going to take the wheel. You know, any issues, problems in your life, he's going to resolve them. Take everything, all right, and lead you to heaven at last. All right, thank you, and see you in our next class. Bye.